Spell. That was Agents of Evil. Next thing is, I believe, going to be... Uh, that's last time was Danforth. This time it's uh, Anne-Marie goes first. Five. Where do I want Anne-Marie to go? Can I go and kill the rat's nest? Uh, sure, I can try. It takes four wounds, has three fight dice. She has six fight dice. One, two, three. We are going to try to fight the rat's nest before it gets too terrible. Okay. So, oh, oh, let's see what else we have here. Spirited attack. We are going to use spirited attack. Okay, so she's going to add her spirit to her combat for this first fight. So this first fight she's going to get plus four for the books, plus four for the spirit, plus two because that's her base combat. So that's ten dice. And she rolls five or higher, like most other people. Four successes! She has successfully removed the rat's nest. Let's see if the rat's nest successfully damages her. No! Whoo! You get for investigation. The rat's nest is gone. Yay. And we encounter the space. So we're at the windmill. Let's see what happens. Broken spectacles, cracked and twisted, these glasses bear a striking resemblance to those worn by Dr. Manning. Make a cunning five plus test and one, gain one investigation for every plus five uh, rolled. If you roll at least once at six, you may also look at the secrets of Dr. Manning. Well, I already know the secrets of Dr. Manning. He's a peeping Tom. But I could use the investigation. What is her investigation? I believe it's going to be plus one, plus one, so five. Two successes, two investigation. Huzzah. Okay. Next, oh, I rolled a four, four, didn't I? I rolled a five. Yeah, she had plenty of time. For this. She was right here, one, two, three. Even if the minus one, she was good. Okay. Scarlet Shadow, one. Really? I'm going to linger. No event, no mystery, good. I get a plus one event. Play on any hero, including yourself, to allow them to add their cunning to their combat for one fight round. I might be doing the lingering rules wrong. I might have to choose to linger before rolling. Okay. Let us... Did I remove spirit? I should remove spirited attack. And... You are going to get Tactical Strike. And you're going to draw from the Manor House again. Moving Portraits. The Manor is filled with sinister looking point paintings. As you walk the halls, you can't shake the feeling that they are watching. Make a honor six plus test. If passed, you may immediately look at the secrets of one town elder. If failed, add a secret to both Lady Hombrook and Lord Hombrook. Well, Lord Hombrook's already an evil bastard, but uh, that actually, I don't know what it'll be 
good or bad for uh, zero successes. Lovely. Okay, so new secrets. I don't think you add secrets to Lord to them after they turn evil. So I'm gonna put that back. I didn't see what it was, but anyway. Because <clears throat> turning evil is like being dead in the terms of investigating them and such. But Lady Hombrook has something other than being a coward involved. Okay. Let's see. Who's next? That was the Scarlet Shadow. It is now time for Adriana. You need to roll one, two, a four or higher. A one. A one. Oh no. No, 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 no. This is going to be bad. I think not. Oh, this is going to be bad. think not. Okay. Okay. Stand forth. Five. One, two, three, four. Let's go back to the abandoned keep. Because I have this magistrate thing. Oh, a relic! I have plus one uh, discard to prevent all wounds deaths done to you from one source. That might be very useful. You have a relic. A relic. It looks like a little cross. Gives plus one cunning. I need to go take you up and have you buy something. Okay. Well, you still need the thing I want you to buy still needs three more investigation, plus one cunning. Okay, you know, let's fix that real quick so it's the same format. Okay, and here we go. Let's see who's closest. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. I'm, it says choose. I'm going to do it randomly. One to three is Anna. Five, four to six is Danforth. Anne Marie. Okay, cannot use items, allies, or militia. I have none of these. Do I, does it move? Nope, I don't move. I just engage in one fight round. Herein lies the problem. She does her damage first. So it's very possible. Adriana failed to. No, actually, it does make sense. Here we go. Okay. Oh, it says engage in one fight round, so it doesn't say move to their location. Usually it does. So Adriana now gets six dice and gets one investigation. Not Adriana, Anne Marie. Good. 
Okay. Now we go on to the normal. Adriana Wolf goes running off into the darkness after being rebuffed by uh, Anne Marie's knowledge of books. Not even magical books, just normal books. Scattered clues! Let's see where the scattered clues are. The church. So two investigations at the church. Okay, what next? Mystery card. Murder. Murder. Roll a d6 and roll a 4 plus, put a feral kit at the same random location. No feral kit. Okay. Where is this murder? The old woods. Three investigation and move the darkness meter one. Yeah. Just a moment. Yeah, that was annoying. Okay. Three investigation in the old woods. There we go. What next? Turns. Okay. Last time, I believe. Adriana was the last person. This time it is going to be so Danforth goes first. No, no, Danforth went first last time. This time it's Anne Marie goes first. Six. I am going to go grab that stuff from the fields. Oops. Do I want to back, grab the stuff from the fields? I can move five. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. Let's go to the manor house. Okay. The bleeding wall. After dinner, the silence is broken by the scream of a servant girl. Rushing to the study, you are aghast to discover the west wall apparently bleeding. Is this trickery or a dark sign of things to come? Make us cunning and spirit five plus test and gain one investigation for every five rolled. So her cunning currently is five, her spirit is four, so that's nine dice. Four successes. And Marie is rolling in the uh, investigation now. Unfortunately, she can't buy a cure for somebody else. Okay. The bleeding wall. Now, who's next? Scarlet Shadow. Six. You can move anywhere on the board you want. Abandoned Keep. Collapse! Roll three dice. Every one or two, take one wound. And blues. Stuff. No ones or twos! Awesome. And... Encounter the keep again. A musket! You are, that is awesome. You are awesome. Very good. Okay. Uh, 
uh, Scarlet Shadow now has a musket, which means his combat is six. Over six feet foot long from bun to bayonet. I want that silver shot. Adriana has enough money for a silver shot. I may want to attack the werewolf very soon. Okay, let's see. I need a three or more. She gets escape again. She's got two escapes now. And Danforth. Five. One, two, three, four. All the way to the old woods again. Now the wood has three investigation. After I investigate the old woods, we'll see what that... The Witch of the Woods. You come across an overgrown hut with flickering firelight in the windows. As you approach, the door opens and you are compelled to enter. Make a spirit six plus test. If successful, gain five investigation. If failed, lose d6 investigation. Your turn ends and you are immediately moved to the town hall. Do I have anything that gives me plus two spirit? Do I have any? Does anybody have anything that will give him spirit? No, no, no. No intuitive hunch. No intuitive hunch. Okay. Need a six on forty six. <laughs> Let's see how much investigation he loses. Five investigation. He loses all of his investigation. And he goes to town hall. Oh! Oh, poor Danforth. At least it's safe at Town Hall. There's nothing in here to get me. It's not like one of my friends has become a werewolf and is right outside the door. No, no, no. I'm perfectly safe here. Yeah. <laughs> okay, start of the mystery phase. First things first. Adriana attacks Danforth. With one success. Ah! One wound. Okay. And let's see if he manages any sort of wound back. He does! He managed to inflict one wound. It doesn't really hurt her, she, but he gets one investigation out of it. Aha! Uh -huh. Already my my awesome my powers of deduction are already concluding, coming to some very interesting conclusions. For instance, our werewolf is blind. Now all we have to do is find a blind person. Hi Adriana, how are you? You're looking at me, aren't you? Okay. Let's see. It is... Oh, shoot. I still have to roll for the regular stuff. Four. I almost skipped mystery phase. Minion attack. Of course. Oh, terrorize. Terrorize, terrorize, terrorize. Where's I think not? I think not well in the course of the werewolf coming out to terrorize the town 
Whereof Adriana clashes with him and keeps him busy through the entire night. Ha ha ha. Werewolf hero becomes useful. That's my my imagination is werewolf versus werewolf combat. Magis Croft Magistrate Werewolf versus Adriana Werewolf bah! All over the town. No and so no terror goes off. It's not all over the town. It's probably in the back streets where nobody notices. That's why there's no terror. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Next. Oh, mystery. The tide of darkness, weight of villain's minions attack, roll once on the villain's minion chart, re-roll in any event. This could get very bad if it is rat's nest. Place that minion as well as well as two investigation at three random locations. This could get very bad. So basically I can only it's only on a two through four. It's a four. It's Feralkin. Set aside three Feralkin. Place them in random locations. Doctor's office. Covered bridge. And old woods. Except for the doctor's office, these are all places that Adriana has been. I wonder if these are people she's bitten, or if these are ones the 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 original werewolf has bitten. So there we go. There's five investigation in the old woods now, and wolf. Okay, so it's uh, Scarlet Shadow first. No, oh, no, no, wait a minute. Last time was Scarlet Shadow first. This time is going to be Adriana first. Here we go. No. Well, I'm confused. I'll bet somebody will notice my mistake next time. I'm beginning to suspect I gave the Scarlet Shadow multiple turns last time, but I don't remember that. That's no, Anne Marie, Scarlet Shadow. Ah, uh, no, no. He was last. So it's the Scarlet Shadow this time. Scarlet Shadow moves one. Linger. You know, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and look up the lingering rule. I'm wondering if I'm doing it right. Oh, when a hero ends their move in the same space that they started their turn on, this is called lingering. So you do roll, but yeah. Ah, no attack. Okay. So draw from the abandoned keep. Can't have a clap. Oh, attacked. I'm attacked anyway. Then again, you know, could have been attacked twice. Werewolf. At 8d6, combat, or higher, four successes. K.O.
Five investigation lost. Didn't even get it. Wait, wait, hold it. I could get knocked away. Let me check something. I say no. Knocked away would work, but I want to see if there's something other than knocked away. Me, uh, nope. And nope. Knocked away is the only thing. You lose your musket. You just got a musket, and now you lose it. Oh, bother. You're not KO'd, at least. And you're not a, vamp a werewolf. That's the important thing. We can, I can kind of handle one werewolf hero. Having two werewolf heroes is a little bit... Is going to be... It's the slippery slope. Werewolf hero is a slippery slope. Okay. Well, <clears throat> you lost your uh, musket. You got one investigation out of that. Whew. It knocked you away and you managed to injure it. Good job. Lost your musket in the process, but you managed to injure it. Okay. Well, now Adriana. Doesn't matter what you roll, you are getting to that doctor's office. But you get another event first. Play immediately, Militia. Another Militia. There are, I think, three Militia cards. One, two, there are four Militia cards. Okay. I got one. I got two out on the board already. Okay, so you get to roll first, and the militia's there, so you get to roll 4d6. You only need one. You killed it. That feral kin is gone, and I can put that kin back in the uh, thing. Now... Feral King gives three investigation. Okay. And what else do I want? Three investigation. Oh, I'm, all, I'm also getting an event because I got the one free for near miss. Play to force a hero, minion, or villain to reroll all their successful to hit rolls for one fight round. Play to cancel any mystery card that is keyword death. Okay, and I am going to roll your spirit. Your spirit and your cunning are the same, so I'm going to roll your spirit to try to get that investigation. You get one of that. So there is now one investigation there. Okay. And you're spending six investigation to cure yourself of being a werewolf hero. There we go. No more werewolf heroes. Uh, Avian is cured. Nobody else is infected. We are good. Okay. I can actually pretend 
she just gets control of it, but because I like werewolves, but okay. Uh, anyway, in any case, whether she gets control of it or it's completely gone, she's not attacking my people anymore. Okay, so that was her. Next is Danforth. Two, which means one. Okay. Uh, Danforth, how much do you have in the way of investigation? You have one investigation. Okay. One, two, three. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll head this direction. There is more investigation in this general direction. Let's draw your events. Did you roll? You, oh, you get two events. You get an event on a one or a two. I wonder if I've been forgetting that. Play immediately. Strength of spirit. What is that Isabel Von Took? I think that's Isabel Von Took. So, he is now spirit five. I really need to get him that rune stone. Plus one, strength of spirit. Okay, they have one called strength of will, which adds to cunning. I would have called straight, would have made strength of will the uh, one that adds to spirit, and strength of mind for cunning. But anyway, oh well, their decision. That was the first one. You get a second one. Play immediately. Gain. Play immediately. Greeted with joy by the locals, you bring hope to this devastated village. You've come to save us. Gain investigation equal to your honor. His honor is four. You want to know something funny? I could spin for investigation to take that card and play it again because it has a quote. Rather ridiculous, don't you think? I mean, I could spin for investigation to get for investigation. It's rather, it's rather silly. I could just I could only do it once per turn, but it results in nothing happening. But it, it's just kind of funny. Oh well. Okay. Who's next? Who is next? Oh, Anne-Marie. Three, which means two. I'll move you to the fields. He's pining for the fjords. Not fjords. That's a mystery. Agents of evil, roll once on the villain's minion chart and place that minion on a board at a random location. Werewolf attack. Shell step track moves one step closer. Uh, Adriana, not Adriana, Anne Marie, we just got people cured of this stuff. I don't think I have any other thing so curse of the werewolf okay Anne Marie how much investigation do you lose three or I could choose to lose a book but I don't want to lose a book so Three investigation gone. Oh, <laughs> she just walks down and says, "Hey, uh, would it be okay if I were to, you know, get cured of the curse of the werewolf?" 